Welcome to Three Minutes and Some Change, where we talk about the hottest topics in the world in about three minutes or less, or somewhere around there. Today, man, we're talking about R. Kelly. He finally broke his silence. He said he was able to finally speak, let the world hear what he had to say about some of the allegations that's going against him about sexual misconduct. He says it's not true. Public opinion say is it true? A lot of people believe it's true, but uh, here go a few clips of the episodes. Y'all check this out. The experts will tell you this. Most people who are abusers have been abused, mm -hmm. but not all people that have been abused go out and abuse others. Okay. And so that's why I asked that's the question. That's what the experts said? That is what the experts said. But they didn't say said. all, did they? No, they didn't. No, all right. No. Here I stand. So that's why I'm asking I'm in the you. Uh, not all. <laughs> I'm in the not all. And, and correct me if I'm wrong, that you have never held anybody against their will. I don't need to. They, why would I? Well, I'm, I'm, How stupid would it never be held for anybody. R. Kelly with all I've been through in my way, way past to hold somebody, let alone four, five, six, fifty, you said. Why, how stupid would I be to do that? I didn't say you That's were holding... That's stupid, guys. I didn't Is this camera on me? <laughs> yes, it's on. That's stupid. Use your common sense. Don't... Forget the blogs. Forget how you feel about me. Hate me if you want to. Love me if you want. But just use your common sense. How stupid would it be for me to, with my crazy past and what I've been through, oh, right now I just think I need to be a monster and hold girls against their will, chain them up in my basement, and, and don't let them eat and don't let them out unless they need some shoes down the street from their uncle. Robert, Stop it. Y'all uh, quit playing. Quit okay. playing. Robert. I didn't do this stuff. This is not me. I, I'm fighting for my life. Yeah, I'm back, man. You know, um, they got the hashtag mute R. Kelly and all that. You know, I, I'm going to say I'm going to let the courts handle that because I'm getting ready for a wedding, my wedding, and uh, I'm playing some R. Kelly. I ain't muting R. Kelly. That's the only R.B. artist I listened to uh, in the past 20, 25 years, him, Usher. You know, it's not many that I really just listen to like that and bought, bought their CDs. So, uh, I'm going to let the courts handle that. And um, what y'all think about the R. Kelly situation, man? Because that's the hottest topic around, especially that he's finally broke his silence and he's speaking with, he's spoken with Gail King. And, you know, he got a lot of real emotional in that um, interview talking about his kids and, and everything that's going on with him. So um, that's what I wanted to talk about today on three minutes and some change. So until the next hot topic, I'll talk about See y'all next time. Jill.